Students from Byron Nelson's Academy of Biomedical Sciences experienced a rare behind-the-scenes look at some of the most advanced medical technology available today. Medical Center Alliance hosted a day-in-the-life exercise to serve as a dry run for the facility before it opens. So Alliance is getting ready to open. They're going to open on the 17th and they asked if we were interested in coming out and running through scenarios with them that they are likely to see. Uh, you know, in their first weeks and months of existence. So because it fits in nicely with what we're doing on campus in terms of uh, the scope of our program, we jumped at the opportunity. So they have set us up with different scenarios, and these kids are participants in the scenarios. So they're acting out the scenarios, and the staff is required to uh, go all the way through from admission through discharge uh, with this patient or with this student who is acting the part of a patient. So the kids get the perspective of the patient, but additionally, they are, they are involved with the conversations between the nurses, the conversations you know, between the doctors and the nurses concerning what's going on, concerning why they're you know, ordering that test, you know, is the hospital ready, are there things that are not working just yet, so the kids have the opportunity to see all of that. It's been fascinating. The new facility will serve many of the Northwest ISD communities and surrounding areas, providing state-of-the-art medical care closer to home. The students from the Academy of Biomedical Sciences were chosen for a specific reason. Well, and this is a shout out to Dr. Rue, but I was chosen for Northwest ISD's Leadership Academy a few years ago, and after going through there and meeting the Dr. Rues of the world and realizing how wonderful your academies were, I was introduced to the AMP Academy, and I knew right then and there that that was the cream of the crop when it comes to some of your students. Not only is it hard to get in the program, but these students are definitely the ones who will be going into the medical field afterwards. I've met many students the last couple of weeks who want to be cardiologists and they have a plan, who want to be oncologists and they have a plan, who want to be nurses, trauma nurses to be more specific, and they have a plan thanks to this AMP program, thanks to Monica and Patrick. Although Medical Center Alliance depended on the assistance of Northwest ISD to provide the students for the scenarios, the students benefited from the opportunity as well. You know, additionally, after we finish, they are really good here at ER Alliance concerning taking us on tours, so we have the opportunity to, you know, view their surgical robots, we have the opportunity to go to the cath lab, to go to radiology, and see lots of the things that we talk about in class, and the kids have the opportunity to actually go in, you know, mess with things, look at stuff, learn by, by touching and by being with that instrumentation. It's something that we can't really simulate very well at the high school. You know, we do our best to have them do research, to have them become familiar through that research, but this gets this hands-on opportunity that it's really difficult for us to give them. You know, today we're doing women's services, so they're seeing, you know, what it's like to go through a labor and through a delivery and what happens when it goes well and what happens when it goes wrong. So um, they're getting a lot of experience in that. My favorite story was last week when a patient, um, a student, who said this is good birth control. <laughs> um, she said that this was eye-opening and that she thought that this definitely would help her to, um, you know, think about when she would plan on having children. So we thought that was a good thing. It's really cool to see like an actual, like a nurse's job and exactly what they do in the different types of fields. So I mean it's pretty cool to see that and become familiar with the staff and stuff here. So wonderful opportunity to do this. Well I wanted to be a trauma nurse but I'm still like deciding I guess but I want definitely consider oncology because of blood and stuff like that. So that'd be pretty cool. So yeah. Thanks to the NISD Partners in Education program, the relationship between Medical Center Alliance and Northwest ISD will continue to grow and change the lives of our students. For more information on the brand new Medical Center Alliance facility, please visit their website at medicalcenteralliance.com.
www.biomedicalsciences.com. To learn more about the Academy of Biomedical Sciences, visit the Byron Nelson High School website. And I, Steve, where kids come first.